Hey everybody, welcome to Burrow Tech. In this episode, we're gonna be asking the question, how much do you actually have to turn off to get deep work done? All right, welcome back. For this video, I wanna make sure you like, subscribe. The more likes and subscribers we get, the more content we can make. So if you've been a fan of this channel, if you've been following me for many years, I always say that it's better to do two hours of focused work than eight hours of lackadaisical work. What I mean by this is that if you just do some focus work, you can actually get more done in the day. And this is something that I think is really, really good. So how much time is the ideal amount of time? Well, believe it or not, if you spend at least 20 minutes to an hour and then maybe take a break at the end of that hour, that is the optimal time. And what I do is I often turn off my internet, I stop checking my stocks, I stop checking Bitcoin. And oh, by the way, fun fact, the more you check Bitcoin's price, the more it goes up. Right? No. But if you turn off the internet and you just focus on whatever it is you're doing, specifically if you're trying to code or make a game or whatever it is you want to do, you turn everything off and just focus and do it. If you do between 20 minutes to an hour, that's the optimal time. For me, once I get to the hour mark, I need to go do something else. I need to maybe either go to the washroom or just get a drink of water or something. But at the end of that hour, I usually take a break and then I do it again. And sometimes I can do more work in that hour than a whole day's work if I don't do those steps. One of the biggest things that is a huge productivity drain is social media. Now, I try to not use social media as much as I can. In fact, I only put on a little bit of time at the end of the week to check my Facebook, etc. And if there is a social media platform that I do use, it's Reddit just to get involved in the discussions because I find that the comment section of Reddit is fairly informative and it weeds out all the BS that you get from a lot of other sites. So why is 20 minutes to an hour the optimal time to get work done? Well, the reason is, is that when you are focused on something, you have to get in the mindset of doing whatever it is that task is. So for example, if you're all over the place, like for example, if you're checking your email, your social media, doing something else, you're not focusing on that work. And it can take maybe 10 to 20 minutes just to get rid of that fog. So oftentimes when I work on something, I literally just try and do it for 10 or 20 minutes and then the real work happens. And when I know that I'm in that zone, the focus zone, I try to get as much done as possible in the least amount of time because I wanna make that time as productive as possible. The first 10 to 20 minutes are setting yourself up for the deep work that is coming ahead. And if you can remember this, then you'll be a lot more productive. Because whatever it is you want to do, whether you want to code an app or make a game or just do anything creative where you deliver a product, it's all about delivering the best possible product in the least amount of time with the least amount of frustrations. If you can get those three factors to work in your favor, you will be more successful in the future. All right, so that concludes this video. I wanna know your comments down below. Do you do deep work? Please post down below. Remember that this channel doesn't do Patreon and we sell our digital products down below. The more we get from the content that you buy below, the more free content on this channel you can make. If you really like this channel and you really like my company, Mammoth Interactive, you can subscribe to our huge library of content. We release 20 to 60 hours of fresh new content per month every month. We release everything from machine learning tutorials to drawing tutorials to guitar tutorials to blender tutorials to game development tutorials and more. Our goal is to get to 10,000 paid monthly subscribers. We have a monthly and yearly option. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another video.